this nonsense, Faustus. Now you want to tell me just what the hell is so important? Sleeping mother. Sacred harbinger. Awaken and reclaim what is yours. You who rise with the moon in darkness. Who prepares the path for the midnight sun. Turn your merciless eyes upon us and arise! Nice show, Doc. Next time, call Zemo. Better yet, I'll just shoot you and save us all the trouble. I can feel it, Rox. Trouble in the air. More innocent blood joining you soon. <laughs> Head back to your magic castle. You ain't welcome here. It's called a sanctum. And welcome or not, this is where fate has determined the Sorcerer Supreme needs to be. Tell fate answers no. This is the secret guardian you dragged me 5,000 miles to meet? Who's the mouth? Mr. Stark is brash, but I assure you, he can be trusted. Wait, you seriously don't know who I am? The fabric of magic is shifting, Johnny. The prophecy of the Midnight Sun is upon us. Your last crusade cost me plenty. This time, I intend to look after my own. Hey, pal, I don't think you understand. Things are changing. Two plus two no longer equals four. Up is sometimes down, and strange here is actually starting to make sense. Do I look like someone who gives a damn about any of that? No, you look like you should be bouncing for the double deuce. Listen, all I know is hell's coming, and my pal here says you can help. That's where you're wrong. Hell's not coming. It's already here. Welcome, Robo Man. Um, Iron Man. It's okay. It's fine. I know what he meant. We come all the way out here, and the old man runs off with that precious page of yours. Uh, could have at least left us some VIP passes for the carnival. Maybe blown up a few monsters on the way out? Johnny Blaze has sacrificed a great deal for this world already. I am certain he will come around given time. Thought you said time was the one thing we didn't have. Uh, all right, let's just wrap this up. I think I've got sand in my nanopolymer weave. Let's do it. Oh, that? It was nothing. That'll work. You might want to get that looked at. 
Am I really gonna have to bring out the big guns for this? Sure, why not? That was really something. We haven't quite broken their spirit yet. Yeah, you're gonna need the help. That suit may be a marvel of technology, but it's no match for the mystic gods. Allow me to demonstrate. Oh, so it's a contest now. Then you take the extra. Glad. Follow my book. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Let's give it a go. I like our chances. Now that I have their attention, perhaps a blessing is in order. Something protective? Well, I could give you a hand, or a shield in this case. In the spirit of cooperation, I'll accept your offer. Just this once. Ah, don't mention it. I thank you. Watch and learn, my friend. Love the effort. This won't end well for you. I know that wasn't your signature move. Challenge the Sorcerer Supreme. Oh, I thought we were finished. I'm afraid the odds still aren't in your favor. I think we pissed them off. Got a spell for that, maybe? Interesting. Something along the lines of the psionic manipulations of Eros of Titan? If you can't make it happen in the next ten seconds, I'm not interested. Apparently, our reputation isn't enough to scare off these so called children of Luth. They don't 
all have to be pretty. And while you ponder arrows, maybe we should just try throwing a big rock at him? Here we go. If I'm being honest, that encounter went better than I expected. Tony, I've been noticing a recurring gamma spike. You see, this is why you shouldn't eat spicy food, Bruce. Localized in the West Village, converging on the Sanctum. What? The collective works of the universe's greatest sorcerers, and he left them underneath the takeout menus. <sighs> Shifting mystical polarities are wreaking havoc on my portals. You don't say. You okay, kid? You. Let's, uh, put a pin in that. Oh. Carol. Bruce and I have been trying to reach you. He'd have come himself, but he's... Oh, you did the big green guy proud. I really showed up my homeowner's insurance. Hydra. Miss Maxim, the wards of protection, if you please. Stephen, I can fight. I've got control now. Then show me by activating the wards. In the meantime, in honor of our missing companion, the rest of you may feel free to smash away. I will not fail. Things are moving right along. Defeating the forces of evil and all that. Nice one, Carol. Always the direct approach. You know I don't mess around. Besides, we picked up some crazy gamma readings coming from, well, here. Guessing that explains the Hydra goons and ominous green lights. Yes, but not why you failed to use the front door. Um, hi, how about you discuss the proper Carol landing after we take down the bad guys? Fair enough. I'm saving my energy until we need it. This shouldn't take long. Not bad. Given up yet. What are we waiting for?
it done any way we know how. Oh, but Davenport was at least a century old. What a waste. Monsters are wild and unpredictable. These ransomers have no gumption. Whoever in service. On beta, moving into position. Let's begin. How do these guys just keep showing up? They are surprisingly relentless. In any event, we must provide Wanda the time she needs to activate the wards of protection. After 80 years of failure, Hydra would throw in the towel already. I'm saving my energy, so we win. They won't know what hit them. Let me show you the way. This should aid me in my fight. Until the end. Oh, sure. Pick on the smart guy. We're three of the world's strongest heroes, right? Doesn't it seem like this should be easier? I've punched through scroll star cruisers that went down faster. Something's up. Yes, Hydra has clearly raised their game. I have a terrible suspicion as to how. The endless search for wealth and power with just a tinge of fascism. Hmm. Hydra will doubt they're paying you enough for what's about to happen. I think these guys got their tactics from the back of a magazine. Interesting tactic. This should be good. That's the spirit. Ready to smack around a few red shirts? It's remarkable how well Hydra manages to attract new recruits despite decades of Next time I won't go easy. Wards. Something's blocking them. Not something. Someone. Gozer? Lilith. 
Mother of demons, harbinger of the midnight sun. Prophecy or not, you overstep. Challenging the Sorcerer Supreme. Be silent. Be still. What just happened? Ow. Be gone. No! A fellow daughter of Transia. Remind me of my own beloved. In virtute Vishanti! Well done, Miss Maximoff. Your unique energy surprised her. Whoa! I'm fine. What? I'm fine. The prophecy is in motion. Lilith is still out there growing stronger each second the Midnight Sun approaches. Define stronger. If we are to have any chance of stopping her, there is only one option left to us. I won't go back there. We all must eventually face our demons, Miss Maximoff. However, one of us should remain behind to maintain the wards of protection. See you on the other side. is unwinding. We are fortunate to be here at all. And where is here, exactly? Salem, Massachusetts. Well, a pocket dimension in Salem, Massachusetts. Oh, suburbs. Nice. Welcome to the Abbey. Home of the Midnight Sun. What the hell is this? Lilith's Junior Demon League? Wait, it's that jerk from TV. Which one? Now, if everyone would just take a moment... Enough! You're standing on my flowers. Oh, been a long time, Sarah. It's caretaker now. If I could have avoided this moment, I would, but... Oh, spare me the speech. I know Lilith's back. We are sisters after all. <sighs> Guess we're suddenly invisible now. Shall we chat, Stephen? No one can argue that the Hunter earned their rest in the first battle against Lilith. I only hope they are up for the task once more. You wizards always make everything sound so lofty. I raised my sister's only child as a weapon against her. And saved the world in the process. Now you want me to dig them up and ask them to do it again. I did not write the prophecy, Sarah. Besides, I am no common grave robber. We are simply reuniting their ethereal essence with their corporal form. Speaking of, it would help to have a mental image for the procedure. Spare no detail. Spiritual identity theft is no laughing matter.
of light and darkness. You who tamed the night. Hear the voice of those who beseech the end. The caller! Wait! Spells are concerned, I've seen worse, particularly on myself. Tony, come on, it's perfectly safe. That thing wakes up and takes a bite out of you. Don't blame me. Visiting hours are over. You can't stay here forever. There's nowhere else I should be. Just saw that Stark guy poking around behind the mirror table. Find me as soon as they awaken, and Blade, be nice. Always am. The air burns with every breath. Has it been so long? I know this place. In my dreams, it was always empty. I am not alone. Have to admit, Hunter, you make one hell of an entrance. Guess that makes two of us. You should have struck when you had the chance, vampire. You will not live to regret your error. Cute, and Caretaker told me to be nice. Relax, Slayer, I'm a friend. You just don't know it yet. Yes, I saw you with Sarah before. But what would she want with a vampire, unless... The name's Blade, and I'm no ordinary vampire. I get you've been out of commission, but I thought you noticed since we're having this little showdown under the freaking sun. A damn peer. Daywalkers were a myth, even to me. Says the half-human, half-demon monster hunter. I do. And last I checked, vampires are monsters. You want to take a run at me? You can try it. But I got my name for a reason. <laughs> I've probably killed more vampires than you've ever seen, hero. <laughs> Such fighting spirit. No wonder Caretaker chose you. Right. As much as I'd love to see how much weirder this conversation can go, we should probably get moving. Agreed. The prophecy is in motion. I can feel it. We have wasted too much time here already. Man, the others are really gonna love you. Others? Yeah, you've got a little fan club, I think. But why spoil the surprise? Hope you're up for the challenge, chosen one.
Hold up. Did I miss something? Or did... Hunter. Not sure if you remember me, but we met briefly before. I'm... The witch who called me back from the grave. Told you. Or Nico, but neither works. And this is... Robbie Ray is. <laughs> oh, man. Never thought I'd be standing next to you. Got quite a rep. I mean, caretakers told us stories. That's Eliana. Privet. And I think you already met Blade. Of course. Caretaker has reformed the Midnight Suns. Well, how did you... Your power. I can feel it. I always do. So... Welcome home. I guess we... I never left. Right. Well, we can fast forward through the tour then. The Abbey is still, well, you know. The Abbey. Basic stuff. Dorms, war room, library, a few places to chill, and, uh, whatever the hell the forge is. I have to say, for a haunted transient castle raised on the cursed grounds of Old Salem, it's pretty cozy. Of course, that doesn't stop us from adding some improvements. We can all thank Robbie for the Wi-Fi. Oh, and one more thing. We've got some new house guests now. You think we're a fun bunch, just wait until you meet them. Speaking of, we're here. Yeah, okay, spend 10 minutes in this place alone, Bruce, then see. Oh, <clears throat> gotta go. Show's about to begin. You following me, Doc? Maybe you should go introduce yourself to the youngins. I'm sure they know of the Sorcerer Supreme, and I wasn't... I, too, was recruited. I, I wonder if you ever ran into any of my predecessors back in the day. We are, uh, ten... Caretaker's home. Ah, uh, did someone give... I imagine Caretaker will have a hard time putting you at risk so soon. Prophecies be damned. It's good to see that face again. You look like it was yesterday. And you look... Older. How long was I in that crypt, Sarah? No more than a few centuries. You were... missed. Centuries? And what of Lilith? Fallen by your hand. Until now. <clears throat> yeah, so, speaking of Lilith... Tony? What? The kid's literally speaking of Lilith. Tony? That's my name. Tony, that's, uh, Carol and Dr. Spooky over there. Here to help. Help with what, exactly? Oh, I don't know. Throwing the magic amulet into the volcano? <sighs> Smiting the dragon mother? You tell us, kid. You are the... Chosen one, after all. Do you recall anything of that last encounter, child? There was... a voice. The rest is... hazy. Oh, a voice. That's it? A voice? That's what we have to go on? Results of your long crypt sleep, most likely. A minor inconvenience. Everything required to restore those memories is contained within my sanctum. I will simply alert Wanda to prepare the necessary rituals. What? Straight to voicemail? Some sorcerer supreme. Must be mystical interference caused by this little pocket dimension of yours. Perhaps Agatha can help. Allow me. Alato. Whoa, what kind of network you run in there? The all-seeing eye of Ereshkigal who judges. Bound to enchanted Babylonian soul glass. We just call it the mirror table. Whoa! 
Wakanda. The Dark Force, pushing against the wards. Steven, where are you? That's impossible. Nothing on Earth could possibly affect those wards. Wanda's in trouble. Wanda is trouble. Alco. You'll need my help, of course. Then let us make haste, Dr. Spooky. Our hunt begins now. How long have you two been sharing a room now? A day? With everything going on right now, we simply cannot afford to lose contact with the Sanctum or Wanda. Given the fluctuations in the astral spectrum, I should be seeing something. Are you ready? The prophecy of the Midnight Sun does not linger, and neither should we. Lilith possesses the Dark Hold. If she forced her way into my Sanctum Sanctorum once, I suspect she can do it again. You are a Sorcerer Supreme. Can you not predict her movements? Normally, yes. But since your mother breached the Sanctum, my sense of the future has grown voluminous in nature. Is that another language, or...? Ah, <sighs> fuzzy. My predictions are fuzzy. For the first time as Sorcerer Supreme, I cannot foresee how the future unfolds, and with my apprentice in danger, we cannot tarry. I understand the urgency. Your apprentice is in grave danger, yes? Wanda is no mere apprentice. She is the Scarlet Witch, one of the strongest magical practitioners I have encountered. But she hasn't channeled such power on her own since... Never mind. One crisis at a time. I do not doubt Wanda's capability, but without my predictive acumen, I cannot bolster the wards should she need it. Still, the wards are woven into the Sanctum's very essence. They should hold. In any case, all will be revealed with time. I suggest we make use of it while it still functions. We should hurry. As much as I'd love to hear a first hand account. About time. Not just about time, Mr. Brooks. Time, space, reality, the building blocks of magic. All must be constant for my portals to work properly. Yet as we now know, that is no longer the case. We've heard. Several times. Otherwise, I would still be hunting dread maidens in my sleep. Indeed. And while I certainly appreciate the view of this vista, I fail to see how it will hasten our return to the Sanctum. Magic is the answer. No, as I've just stated, magic is the problem. Your magic is... not ours. The ground you are standing on exists within two worlds. A mystical anchor point to Ileana's realm that allows her to... well... I'll just let her show you. Should be an easy. Wanda belongs here. Bring her best. You are standing in 
limbo. Nexus of all realities, both real or otherwise. A chaotic but secret realm beyond the influence of Lilith. Thus far. Are you certain of that? Because I am sensing all kinds of dark energy. That feeling you're being watched. General Hellho vibe? Yes. All these potentialities converging at once? A truly surprising feat, Miss Rasputin. For someone so young, of course. You think this is crazy? Wait until you see Manhattan. From here, magic can open gateways to just about anywhere on our planet, and beyond. We don't want to risk punching through the wards protecting your sanctum, Doctor. At least we know the wards of protection are still in place. For now. I suggest we hurry. Arm Alpha in position! I hesitate to call this good news, but I'm seeing minimal Hydra resistance between you and the Sanctum. Looks can be deceiving, I'm afraid. There's no way these foot soldiers are behind the disruption of the wards of protection. search for wealth and power with just a tinge of fascism 
Hmm. Hydra will never change. Mother of demons is forced to rely upon hired hands occasionally. I hope this is one of the stronger arms. We did come all the way here for a fight. how well Hydra manages to attract new recruits despite decades of ineptitude. ever facing me we'll have to deal with a few more I'm afraid this should help that gamma spike we detected in your area seems to be growing let's assume that's not a good thing gamma or not I feel the hand of my mother at work here Battle requires. Let's give it a go. Never seen that before. It's on. That was really... something. For a high drop! You think that would stop me? Wanda is calling out to me. I feel her struggle. Need to concentrate and... Ah! And I... Again? Hail that! Wait. 
for Hydra. I'll return the favor in kind. Guided as they are, remember, Hydra is still human, Hunter. Not Lilin. You were saying? The lifeblood of the Mother pumps through our veins. The Mother is eternal. Hydra is eternal. One of bed. Quickly, do I even want to know what that beast is? It calls itself Venom. Until now, a pale imitation of a very heroic young friend of mine. We will feed your ugly tongue to the spider wizard. Marinate it in his stomach juices and eat it with his spleen. forced to rely upon hired hands occasionally. I haven't felt this good in years. You were too weak for this fight. Light will carry you on. I thank you. No more games. You are a force to be reckoned. me in my fight. Look how fragile you are. Can't break free. No pain. This 
house belongs to Mother. As you belong to us, we shall start with your juicy entrails. Then, slowly savor your delicious brains. Are the rest of your mother's children so chatty? Thankfully, no. Just like old times. Mother abandoned. My friends. See if they have an answer for this. Pain only makes us hungrier. Don't tire yourself out now. haven't given up yet. We may not be ready for this thing yet. Might be smarter to pull back until we know what we're up against here. Yes. Surrender. Be eaten. Fill our belly with your justice here. I shall fill your belly with my plague demon. Now you've done it. 
time to lick our wounds. Know my reputation. Our belts are responding. Mother blesses us with power. Mother blesses us with strength. We protect the mother and are rewarded with your meat. And to think Lilith was a vegetarian. Mercy for the servants of Willow. You are lucky to still be breathing. Is that truly your best? Get the blood bumping. No half. Stay dead. No escape from me, demon. Hold up. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. Friendly. Seemed like you folks could use a hand, Doc. <coughs> Spider Man! Jeez, Eddie, what happened to you? That's part of a horrifyingly terrible new look. The tongue was gross enough, but. Whoa! Someone is extra touchy today. We will rip your face off and suck the marrow from your bones! Always nice to see you too, buddy. So, I'm thinking your friends here could use a little break. How about I take Eddie here for his afternoon walk? Don't worry, Doc. That's just his way of safety cares! 